Hello everybody, my name is Acid Sama. I am the co-programmer for Terradrome. Uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to get online with the game and play. Uh, what you're going to want to do is click on the shortcut named Terradrome Net Play. Uh, once you do that, this will load up our small program that will uh, enable the ports to be opened. Uh, once you see this screen, uh, you'll see server, host, and client. Uh, the best way to get online and play is to click client. Uh, this will enable you to be able to have challenges sent to you by other players. Uh, but since the, the first program that loads up, it actually opens your your port right here of uh, 7500 on the uh, UDP protocol. Uh, you can go ahead and click host and click OK. Let's see, for me, I can't click host because the server is running. So for me to actually get on the server, I, I will click client and then click OK. And then you'll be welcomed, you know, welcome to FMHQ uh, Netplay server and you know you'll you'll see you know any patch releases or special notes um, uh, pretty much once you get on you'll see like say for example uh, Apple Blossom here you can right click and click challenge and it will immediately load the game uh, you'll be able to play uh, if you see you know my my other name right here this is the server I'm running uh, whenever you're not wanting to play because people will get on the server and instantly challenge you if you're not in rest mode uh, if you're not not in a playful mood uh, just go into the chat and type rest and then you know you hit enter and you'll enter you know rest mode and be yellow here uh, to get out of rest mode just hit type in rest again uh, the program has uh, many commands. I always go to help and bring up the commands list. Uh, also, another note: uh, when you click the options here, uh, you know you have your max stages and stuff like that. Uh, usually, I keep mine to one because some of the people I play. Uh, most well, some of the other stages, you know, they they cause frame rate lag in uh, online play. Uh, but if you're wanting to, you know, have a full tour of all the stages, you just set the maximum stage number uh, to what Terradrome has. So pretty much, go ahead and go ahead and you know issue a challenge to somebody. And, you know, once you're done playing, you can always just go ahead and close the program or just set your, you know, status to rest mode. Uh, some people actually have issues with saving a replay. Uh, every time you, uh, you were to do that, you know, you could easily, if you did save a replay and you wanted to view it, you know, also type the command in replay. And then it will load up, you know, all your matches that you've had with people. And then, you know, you'll click on, say, like, me versus alien or, you know, me versus ghost or somebody else that's been on the server. And uh, it'll actually load the game up and you'll be able to watch that match. Uh, easily enable you to be able to record that match and put it up on YouTube later. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's... That's pretty much how you get online and play the game. Uh, I've actually uh, have enjoyed playing this online. I would really like for you know people to understand the game more because here lately I've been not losing. <laughs> uh, I guess it's because you know me being the co-programmer and all. I know everything there is about the game. Uh, not a lot of people know about certain things you can do, but 
it's always about going into training mode. Uh, if you don't know how to access training mode in the game, uh, we come to a consent that we did not, we lost the font we actually had for the uh, demos. So uh, Rise of Right now, uh, the training mode is actually hidden. Uh, if you're in the game, just uh, hit up if you're on player one or go down below player two. Uh, the, coaster, the coaster will be on a, you know, non-existent uh, text. But if you hit enter, you know, it's going to take you into training mode. Uh, always remember to set your uh, team versus mode rounds to one uh, because training mode, you is based off of uh, a team based uh, game mode but a lot of people don't really use that game mode uh, for team battle due to the fact that uh, team battle doesn't really work all that well with a uh, fighter maker second but uh, anyway that's a little tidbits on how to play online and a little bit more uh, just come join us on the server uh, and new versions should be out next Halloween. Uh, as always, uh, always uh, register on uh, fmhq.us. Uh, this is the main place where I can post up any updates for the game or screenshots of any new content I will be adding. But anyway, we'll see you guys.